Hi guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to show you guys my 90s blowouts or blowouts in general without using any rollers. So I'm going to show you guys the products that I'm going to use. So I just got a shower as you can tell because my hair is wet. So the first one I use is this Garnier Leave-In Conditioner. Next product is this Biotin Boost Roth. Real Raw 7-in-1 Leave-In Thick and Fuller. So it's not a leave-in conditioner because it sits in the back. One of my aunts gave it to me. She's a hairstylist. But I've been using this since October because that's when I got my last haircut. And I kind of do see like a difference when I put it on my hair. Like it leaves it so smooth and so shiny at the same time. The last product I'm going to use is this heat protector as again my aunt she gave it to me because she's a hair stylist i feel like that's the only person i trust cutting my hair or dyeing my hair but with this heat protector you have to be really careful if you guys are interested in buying it first time i used it i was straightening it or curling my hair but it was a long time ago i don't remember but i sprayed it and it got really really greasy which it looked like i haven't showered for days and it looks so disgusting so before you're using it just spray it on your palm of the hand two or three times and just rub it onto your hair if you spray it a lot into your hair it's going to get really greasy and it's going to look disgusting so don't do that mistake like i did products in my hair i'm gonna start blow drying it the way how i blow dry my hair is that i section it in two pieces i will blow dry this side first then after i'm done i'm gonna blow dry the other side because it's like more easier and faster to do i don't brush my hair right now because my hair is really really sensitive blow dry my hair my hair looks a little bit puffy but we're gonna fix that in a bit now we're gonna go on to my blowout i'm gonna show you guys what i use for my blowout so i'm gonna use this red lawn i don't know what to call i just probably put it in the screen i got this for christmas a year ago or two i think that's a year ago i'm just gonna use this for now because i don't have a dyson i don't have a shark I'm not rich like that. I mean, I could buy it. I just don't want to, you know. I'm going to just stick with this one. As long as it's good and it works, that's all that matters. So, I am brushing my hair back. And we're going to section it. I have layers, so I'm trying to get the layers, but sometimes I can't because some are bigger than the others. And the other ones are smaller. So, we're going to section my hair and we're going to start my blog. Yes, all you gotta do is say yes. Don't think I'm what you feel, baby. I'm to ask you, baby. Open up your mind and just rest. I'm about to let you know you make me so. All you gotta do is say yes. Don't think I'm what you feel, baby. I'm to ask you, baby. Open up your mind and just rest. I'm about to let you know. I'm done with this side. When I'm doing my blowouts, I like to go upwards, or sometimes I like to go upwards and I keep like repeating it and then go downwards so I can get like a little wave I don't put any hairspray because I put one more product which we're gonna get to that later but I'm gonna start doing this side and I'm gonna just do the rest
don't mind my hair we're almost finished but i separated my hair how i show you guys instead of going this way i'm doing it upwards because i want it to be more volume and more um fluffy so i could get like the 90s fluffy hairstyle or blowout so that's what i'm gonna do for the rest of the hair that's left <laughs> This part you just have to play around with it. It looks nice, a little swoop moment. But you just have to play around with it. How I style it or how I do it my way is that I part it in the middle. And then I'm just going to grab this oil. The last product I'm going to use is this Fruit Sleek Hair, which my aunt gave it to me. I'm just going to put a little bit because I don't want my hair to be really, really greasy. This is how much I put. And that's basically how I do my blowouts. It doesn't take like a long time, but it took a long time because I'm filming. But it takes me like 10 to 15 minutes or at least 20. But this is how I do my blowouts mostly every day if I don't want to do any other hairstyle this is how i do my blowouts i'm just gonna fix it here but yeah that's my blowout thank you guys so much for watching this video don't forget to like comment and subscribe don't forget to follow my social medias to see behind the scenes and i see you guys next time i upload bye